What's wrong with them? What are you talking about? They're so quiet. Are they on medication? No, they're just smart like you. I've been going to school in a zoo. Not sure about these uniforms. They're kind of frou-frou. Sheldon, I've been looking over your transcripts, and I must say I'm very impressed. Thank you. What's your doctorate in? Non-commutative algebraic topology. I like her. It's going to be weird around here without Sheldon. Don't you mean less weird? That's not nice. I wasn't trying for nice. You sure you're not jealous because your little brother's moving up in the world? Hey, I got plans of my own. Do tell. Soon as I graduate high school, I'm going to be a professional male model. That is hilarious. What? I'm good looking. No, that you think you'll graduate high school. The model thing was funny, too. I must tell you, in all the years I've been here, I have never seen such glowing letters of recommendation from a student's teachers. Well, that's real nice to hear. Now, listen to this. Putting aside his superior intellect, Sheldon is a delight to have in the class. He's fun-loving, easy to get along with, and always ready to help another student. That doesn't sound like me at all. Sure it does, sweetie. Dr. Douglas. Oh, no, please call me Flora. Flora, I have to ask about the living arrangements. That's our main concern. Well, I think I can reassure you about that. My husband and I have been hosting a student for the last several years who recently graduated and is now at Princeton. So we have a guest room available in our home. Well, that's very generous of you. Is your husband work at the school also? No, he's retired. He was an astrophysicist for NASA. Please tell me you don't have a dog. No, we're both allergic. I'm tingling. <laughs> Mimo? Mimo? What? Wow. I know, I look great. I got your little going away gift. Come on in. This necklace has been in our family for generations. It belonged to a Comanche warrior who gave it to your great-great-great-great-grandma. Why'd he give it to her? Well, according to family lore, she was uh, a very accommodating young lady, and uh, they hit it off. That's a bird feather. Eagle feather. Doesn't matter. I don't like birds. Birds are filthy. Okay. Fine. One featherless family heirloom for you to take with you and keep you safe while you're away. You don't actually believe this has magic powers, do you? Oh, for God's sake, just say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. There's a price tag on it. No, there's not. <laughs> 